Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we're going to look at our select statement and look at fetch all for SQLite. And if you're new here, thanks for joining us. This is what we do. We take one subject and build upon it. So all right, we've learned about fetch one, fetch many. Now we're going to learn about fetch all. So let's just go ahead and run this. It's OK. And if you haven't hit that subscribe button uh, and the notification bell, just go ahead and do that right now. So all right, we have a cursor object. And just so we can look at the documentation here, let's go ahead and look at it. So this is, this is important. Fetch is, fetch is all remaining rows, so important. And then if it's empty, if you've exhausted it, it will return an empty uh, list. So let's just go ahead and look at this. So print our cursor object and fetch all. Close that out. Boom. All right. Let's go ahead and close our connection. Let's rerun this. So this is important. I want to, oops, I don't know if I did that. There we go. So let's do our cursor. Print cursor dot fetch one. OK. Now we're going to do our remaining. Print cursor dot fetch all. Close that out. So we now have our remaining three. And let's just check, make sure everything is gone. Boom. Empty list. So now we know and have in our toolkit all three of our fetch methods for our cursor object fetch one fetch many, fetch all. And we also understand that one, of course, is, is like our next function. Many is it is going to use the array size that we give it. And, and it also is next. Everything about this is very similar to our next function. And then if it is empty, I get an empty list at the end. OK, so there we go. Real, real quick video today, but absolutely awesome feedback. Tons of good questions, wonderful questions, um, really, uh, really some good ideas heading me down in the direction that we need to see because the last one uh, about NumPy, uh, the, the problems with that, great, great question. Just. I just can't say thank you enough. All the wonderful comments of support, thank you for that, and all the new subscribers. We are so glad to have you here, and please don't hesitate to ask any questions. If you have that question, somebody else has that same question. So you're helping yourself out, but you're also helping somebody else out, and you're also making me a better instructor. So thank you for that. So as always, Please drop any comments, questions, video requests below, and I'll get right to them. And as always, thanks for watching. Stay tuned, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.